I knew you were coming in. So I practiced some of my dance moves really? for you. Cool. And I would like to sort of show you what I've learned. First, I think we need to pick a, 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 a stripper song? name for me. Oh, a stripper. What's up, guys? Nikki Novak here in the Young Hollywood studio with the star of Magic Mike and Rodriguez. How's it going? It's going great. How are you doing? Good. Thanks so much for coming in. Thank you for making this movie. <laughs> On behalf of all females and males out there, <laughs> was there anything you read that you were just like, oh gosh? Well, I think the part when you knew you had to be in a thong and that was going <laughs> to happen more than one time, you were just like, oh, what am I getting myself into? Am I really right. about to do this? And then you look down and I'm like, how am I going to pull this off? Like, okay, you know. so eating this regime, getting ready for the movie and in the movie, let's, let's break it down. Okay. Break it down, let's get serious. All right, let's get serious. Step one. Step one. You gotta commit. Ooh, we are getting serious. Okay, you gotta, gotta commit. commit. Did you say like a mantra every day? Please don't eat any donuts yeah. and ho-hos? Yes, I mean like every moment was a commitment. Every drink that got put down on the table, every dessert that passed my way. I so was it like I, everything in life when you can't have it, you want it more? Of course, I mean it was misery. I mean, you know, I never wanted any of these things as badly as I wanted them during this time, but right. you know, I was committed. I mean, you had to make that commitment. You knew you were gonna show up on set, Matt McConaughey, Channing Tatum, you know, Joe Manganiello, and, and you know that these guys are coming to, to work in tip top shape. That's so, right, so what was the workout routine like? Workout routine was an hour and a half, two hours of cardio a day, super, super strict diet, and uh, an hour of weight. But you've always kind of had to be in shape. Like when you did CSI Miami, how I've did you sort of days. take a fresh take on this and like <laughs> say, okay, I've been at this level before. Right. Yes. I mean, you know, I've been in good shape, been in bad shape, sort of been up and down with it over the years. You get comfortable on a Are TV you a show. Are you know? Yeah, you know, you're hanging out on a TV show, life is good, it's easy, you got a steady gig, and you're not worried about having to have your shirt off that often, you know, on CSI. So I, I definitely have had my lazy periods, and, and Magic Mike sort of caught me in like the middle of one of those, and so it was like time to really- It caught you off guard. Get focused, yeah. I mean, so when you rapped, did it all, no, I've been really working my hardest to to hold on as as much as I can. Okay, uh, so on set, too. who was the person that most likely was at the craft services, like sneaking a red vine mm. or two or five? Channing. <laughs> oh, we call him out. I love it. <laughs> Channing. Actually, but we, we talked were about all monitoring each other. We were all like, "What are you doing?" What are you, what are you going you, for? Though? What do you got? <laughs> you know, and everybody was just waiting for the day to be done so that we could drink and. Well, and, let's and take it out. back a little bit. The first derobing. Like, was there a day that you guys were all on set together? Because there had to be that, like, check the other guy out. How did I do? Sort of like. <laughs> no, we um. We, we actually we broke the ice in the dance routines in the dance rehearsals. I'm sorry, we had oh you dance had rehearsals rehearsal. leading up to the now. Movie did you invite so. females to those dance rehearsals to give you? No, we didn't invite any, but there were two <laughs> present. The two choreographers were females, but they've know. seen it all before. You you could, probably could have sold a lot of tickets just to that. <laughs> just to the rehearsals. Yeah. I talked to Matthew McConaughey before about the film. And I said to him, you know, who spends more time in the makeup chair, particularly in this movie, because typically guys are like, oh, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. You know, they don't yeah, want to spend yeah. a lot of time. Who spent the most time? Most time in makeup. I will say, everybody got a little bit vain. We were all pretty vain in this sense, because I mean, listen, you put all this time into getting into shape. So you just wanted to make sure everything was right. You wanted to make sure you're, you know, you were bronzed up. So and, they bronzed you, know, every... you up, did they oil you up? Um, what was the ritual? The ritual was, you know, everybody got a spray tan. Everybody went and got waxed. Did we I see something on your Twitter committed. about you were having your legs waxed and you were like, girls, well, it's that not wasn't as bad just... as, as you, you know. Yeah. And I'd like to call you out on that a little well, bit. Well, and I'd like to respond. Because you only had the legs waxed. No, I was just going to say. <laughs> oh. I was being discreet. The, the legs were just the beginning. We started with the legs and went to every crack and crevice <laughs> along the way to the top. I, but yeah, I got everything waxed. So you know what it I feels like to full, be a woman? Yes, I know what it's like to go through that But experience. you said it wasn't that bad. And it wasn't that bad. Wow. It, uh, listen, it wasn't comfortable. It's not something <laughs> that I'm like, mm, I would love to do that again. But the regrowth was actually worse than the waxing. The waxing wasn't that bad. It was actually when it grew back in, it was like, okay, now I get it. Like, you know. See, now you can relate to women in ways that you never have before. And it's just, you know, 
This film has helped you in so many in more ways. And how about I the dance lessons? Yet to realize. How are the dance classes? Dance, dance? Like, you want to talk about helping my life? The dance lessons changed my life. How so? Because I realized that whether you're good or bad at dancing, which I've always considered myself a pretty poor dancer, but I'm not really a dancer. Put a, you know, then you put a partner there and, and then I got two left feet. So the choreography, all of a sudden I realized, I'm like, you know what, I love dancing. It's so liberating. Like you just really feel free when you're dancing. When you let go and you have to focus on whether it's staying in step with everybody else or whatever it is, it's so much fun. It's like a meditation. Well, speaking of which, Adam, I knew you were coming in. So I practiced some of my dance moves really? for you. And I would like to sort of show you what I've learned. First, I think we need to pick a, 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 a stripper name for me. I know there's, a, there's that little game you can play to pick your porno name, right? What is, is it the it's street your, you grew up on, the, you your first pet, or some order of that? I'd like you? you to meet Angel Hawthorne. Angel, <laughs> very nice to meet you. Oh, Alrighty. before I forget, we have something for you. Ooh. <laughs> Money! We're sweetening the deal a little bit. Oh, I love it. So, we only have $8, so don't okay. spend it all in one place, okay? okay. Each move, you'll so grant you me a, count. a reward based on how well I do. <laughs> Just check. Are we ready? All right, we're going to have people from the Young Hollywood audience call out a dance move, and I'm going to do it. Are we ready? Go on more. All right, are we ready? Well, I like it. I like it. Okay, okay. I think I'll, 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 I'll Just a dollar! What do I have to do it over? What, do what is do this now? This is the pony, ride the I'm pony. No, I like the other one. Yeah. 50 cents, hold on, I got change for that. I don't have change. This next machine move, don't next give move, change. Next move. This is good. Okay, okay, keep it going, keep it going. What's next? Oh, that's it, that's it. Woo! You got it all. I'm broke. I'm going on broke. How did I do? Fantastic. <laughs> I, I take it I'm not getting cast in the sequel. <laughs> I think you got a good shot, actually. I'm very impressed. You were very free with your movement. You let loose. You had a good time. Smiled. You're too kind. And I'm out of money. I mean, you did your job. I've got nothing left. He's broke. I'm out of breath. We better wrap.